Alright guys, so today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do Summoner's War uh, JSON file. Uh, so you're going to want to download BlueStacks. You're also going to want to download uh, BlueStacks Tweaker. And you're also going to want to download Summoner's War, Google Drive, and Root Certificate. I'm going to leave all the descriptions, or all the links in the description for you guys, so you don't have to worry about that. So you come here, you download everything. Once you've got everything downloaded, you're going to bring up your tweaker. And you're going to go all the way to the root tab right here. Uh, right here it's going to say unlock. You hit unlock. And then it's going to have you close the opt or blue stack. You close blue stacks, you open it back up, and this is where we're at. Uh, once you do that, you're going to, actually I'm going to bring up the direction so I can do it with you guys. So you're going to want to hit control or windows key R. Um, whoops. Sorry guys. We are going to come over here. You're going to copy that. Uh, command prompt. So you're going to just copy that, paste it. And then this is where some people are probably going to get messed up. You do not copy what I do. So I'm just copying it just because it's easier. You're also going to want to download the exporter, which I will leave a link in the description also for that. 0 0.21 so you're going to want to put in what yours says so the first uh, these numbers right here is your IP it's going to come up right in here I think it's your IP and then your port is going to be 8080 you hit enter you hit enter <laughs> you hit enter there we go I don't know why that was doing that and then it's going to ask you to restart BlueStacks it automatically does it so what I do is I come back to the tweaker you hit start there you go uh, the next step is okay. So the next step is actually very easy. So you're gonna want to hit start proxy, and then you're gonna hit get cert, and this is where it's gonna copy that certification to. Uh, once you do that, you're gonna want to go into your computer, and you're gonna want to find that. So it is under Summoner's War files. Might be a little different for you guys. And then you go to cert, and then I forgot what it actually is called first. I I honestly don't remember. But you're just going to change the name to uh, ca.crt, okay? ca.crt, that's what you're going to change it to. Once you do that, um, you're going to upload that folder to your Google Drive via your computer. Uh, once you do that, you literally just come in here. You make sure that it is in here, which it is. So you're going to back up, you're going to hit your root certificate, you're going to click on this little folder, you're going to upload it from your Google Drive, you hit import, successfully copied, you're going to go back, uh, make sure your proxy is on before you start Summoner's War, and then just kind of watch your, uh, just watch your proxy and make sure everything's working. You'll know if it's working, because it won't say anything. Sorry guys, the baby's crying over here. I'm trying to make a quick video for you guys. Now, the biggest thing is make sure you rename that folder. And there we go, save profile. There's the JSON file. And that's it guys, it's very, very easy to use. When I first did it, I was very confused. Um, like I said, there is a small chance you could get banned because Summoner's War does not let you use emulators, but a lot of people. Also, another thing, you cannot play with this root activated. I'm not going to show you how to deactivate the root because I don't believe you should play on Nox because I don't want you to get banned. But I think it's okay for it, for getting the the files. Um, and that's it, guys. That's, that's really it. I appreciate you guys watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.